हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू आर क्लास टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट क्लास सिक्स साइंस चैप्टर नंबर वन सोर्सेज ऑफ फूड एंड टूडे इट इज आर थर्ड क्लास ऑफ चैप्टर वन सो स्टूडेंट्स इन प्रीवियस क्लासेस वी हैव कवर्ड दैट व्हाट इज फूड व्हाई डू वी ईट फूड वैरायटी ऑफ फूड एंड द सोर्सेज ऑफ फूड इन ब्रीफ टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट विद द टॉपिक ईटिंग हैबिट्स ऑफ एनिमल्स so students as we all know that all animals eat food and the different animals eat different kinds of food as some animals eat only grasses and leaves and some eat only flesh from the other animals and some animals also eats both plants and flesh so students depending upon on the basis of their food habits animals are grouped as herbivores carnivores and omnivores so herbivores are the animals which eats only plants carnivores are the animals that eats only flesh and omnivores are the animals which eat both plants and animals so students let's understand these all the types of animals in brief first of all herbivores herb meaning plant vores meaning eat so they are the animals which eat only plants and they eat only grasses leaves seeds fruits and other plants products so what are the examples of herbivores examples of herbivores are cow buffalo horse mainly eat it grass and goat and sheep eat leaves fr from shrubs around and giraffe is the tallest of all the herbivores and it eats leaves from the top of the trees which are beyond the reach of other herbivores and herbivores are also called herbivorous animals now let us understand the carnivores carnivores are the animals which eat flesh from the other animals carnal meaning flesh and vores means eating so vores means eat so what will be the carnivores carnivores are the animals which eat the flesh of the other animals and we can say that carnivores are meat eaters animals like tiger lion wolf frog spider eagle and vulture are carnivores and carnivores are also called as carnivorous animals now let us understand the term omnivores omni means all kind vores means eat so omnivores are the animals that eat 
both the plants and animals they eat the plants products also and the animal products also so what are the examples examples are man fox dog and crow so students see here the picture of omnivorous animals so omnivorous animals are also called omnivores now students let us understand three new terms here the first is poultry poultry means they are the domesticated birds kept by humans for their eggs and for their meat and for their feathers now next term is apiculture apiculture means practice of bee keeping for honey and wax so for the honey and wax we uh, we do the practice of keeping bees so this practice of uh, bee keeping for honey or and wax is called apiculture and what is pisciculture pisciculture is related to the fish farming right food culture of different regions in india india is country with varied climate and culture and so is the food in hill in hills and in south of india people food is mainly rice and curry in the north punjab haryana rajasthan madhya pradesh and uttar pradesh people eat loaves meat is eaten all over the country fish and seafood is eaten by the people living along the sea coast region fish is also a common food for the people living near water bodies as such in india we find south indian food punjabi food rajasthani food bengal food and others common men's food all over india is roasted grains roasted gram roasted peanut and sugar or jaggery coated roasted and in the form of laddu or chikki that's all about uh, the content of this chapter now let's see some questions for the homework so here is your homework the question number 1 is which one of is a stem a carrot b radish c ginger and d turnip so in this questions you have to take the correct option which one is not a stem question number 2 options are turmeric potato beet and ginger question number 3 which one is a pearls option r rice soya wheat and maize question number 4 which one is not a pearls options are p gram millet and soya question number 5 which is not an edible oil options are coconut oil mustard oil sunflower oil and castor oil question number 6 is which one is a fungus options are mushroom egg cheese and fish question number 7 is which one is an animal product options are flour sprouts milk and sugar question number 8 which one is a herbivore options are lizard frog 
rabbit and snake question number 9 is which one is a carnivore options are squirrel frog rabbit and rat and question number 10 is which one is an omnivore options are parrot fish spider and lion so students that's all about today's class and i hope you are doing your homework and very soon we will meet in next class till then you all of you take care and bye bye